Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am doing my TJ Maxx and Marshalls finds for the week. I do this every single Sunday and I go to TJ Maxx and Marshalls shopping their beauty section and seeing what is new. So we go over the latest items that the store is getting in. And just so you guys know, I do go to the store multiple times a week and to many different stores. So this is not all just from one store. It's kind of hard because I do have to go to multiple to find all these things, but this is my favorite thing to do and I just love it it's kind of like a treasure hunt to see what I can find but anyways I'm sure you guys are ready to see what we found we found some amazing stuff this week we got sorry the light is like coming in strong today we have some new milk makeup goodies we have Mac showing up and some exciting new skincare stuff there's a lot of good stuff in this video so definitely subscribe if you are new here you do not want to miss out on these amazing deals and let's get to shopping we are starting this week's find off with the cute Ray Dunn mug this is the let it snow mug i always find really good mugs on mondays it seems like but not much makeup so far but i do have hopes that we're going to see a lot of cool stuff this week since last week was pretty slow but i'm obsessed with this mug so had to show you guys and i'm going to be showing you my ray dunn collection probably this week with all my christmas decor looks like they also put out this really big dry bar set which looks nice this is the big hair blowout kit which has a it looks like full-size dryer southern belt mousse there's these rollers a round brush and then the triple sec finishing spray for the perfect blowout um this looks like a past holiday set with all the little snowflakes on it and this one is 99.99 so thought i would share that because dry bar is a pretty popular hair care brand over at marshall's they have this estee lauder lip kit which has five full sizes of their color mv gloss collection um it kind of has like the different card shapes on them this is originally 35 going for 19.99 here the shades are seductive honey wild mink red extrovert suggestive kiss and then fiery almond marshall's also put out these little baby uh, matcha toners from milk makeup this is a solid toner that balances and calms the skin for purified hydrated skin this is 3.99 for the little mini and they also have to go with that the matcha cleanser so you could do the little set oh my goodness you guys i cannot believe that this is here the full size vegan milk cleanser from milk makeup we've been seeing so many like minis and other things from milk but i did not expect to see the cleanser especially at the full size this is insane i'm definitely gonna get this 7.99 is a crazy price for this and they also have a mini one how cool is that so they have the mini for $4.99 definitely grabbing the full size for sure i'm like do i need backups of this this is such a good price but yeah i cannot believe that is here i'm so excited probably my favorite thing this week i would love to find the full size moisturizer but we did see the mini for the vegan milk moisturizer but this definitely surprised me today. How cool is this? I was looking for this because some people have been finding them from Urban Decay. It's the Lip Chemistry Lasting Glossy Tint from their Wired Collection. So this is just a tinted, I think it's like a glossy color. This is only $4.99 and the shade is Gravity, so it's this purple. And then I'm also seeing that they have tons of different MAC lipsticks in, so I guess I can go over some of those. But most of these I've already shown like in past videos, but they have Hey Frenchy, Bated Breath, Dozen Carnations, Under the Covers, the French Silk. I don't think I've seen that one before. There's DGAF, As If I Care, Shrimpton, that's a good one. And then Dare You for the MAC lipsticks, and those are usually $7.99 a piece. So I have this Cream Sheen lip gloss from MAC as well. In the shade is Boy Bait. This one is $5.99 seeing this again from Urban Decay. I found this a couple weeks ago, the Cannonball Mascara for $9.99. A lot of you guys said that you really like this one, so it's a waterproof mascara. I'm super excited about this find. I knew it was coming since we saw all those MAC lipsticks. This is at Marshalls. They have the MAC Extra Dimension Skin Finish in a Double Gleam. These are so gorgeous, and it's $14.99 here. I feel like they always price MAC a little bit higher. I'm, I think I want to get this because I think this will be a nice shade for me. I almost bought this at like the cosmetics company store but i decided not to and i think it is a little bit cheaper here so i think i'm gonna grab this one it looks so gorgeous also have this cute little mini kopari toothpaste and this is their charcoal one i've actually heard this is great for whitening the teeth but it's just a little size going for 2.99 kopari recently sent me a bunch of stuff and i've been really enjoying their brand i think they make some awesome products it's all centered around like coconut oil but they have some awesome things so i thought that was a cute little find 
So I also found this apple cider mug as well, which I'm going to get for a friend. But I thought that was really cool because I think these came out for the fall. But they had this and peppermint mocha, but I already have the mocha one. So I'm getting this one. And then I had to share, I found this really cute Penrose perfume set. I remember so many of you guys told me that I need to try their perfumes. And they have this little adorable kind of trial set. This is the Rollerball Style Kit with nine unique fragrances. I kind of want to get this. It's $29.99, so it's a little bit pricey. But you guys have been telling me that you love their stuff. So I'm like, I need to try this. I think it was the Secret Genius one that you guys raved about. So, hmm, I'm thinking I might get this. We will see, but I think that's a really cool find. Looking over here, it looks like they put out more from this Iman brand, which you guys told me a little bit more about. So they have tons of stuff from them. There's this Luxury Contour Trio for $3.99. They actually set this up super cute too and put it in these little boxes. There's a second to none luminous foundation. And then this looks interesting from them. The sheer finish bronzing powder. This is in afterglow bronzer. And then there's this, the luxury translucent powder. So they have so much stuff from this brand here. Looks like they're getting more and more of it. And then I found a new shade in the Bare Minerals Bare Pro lipsticks, which you guys know I love these. This is in the shade of Bloom, and it is $5.99. Definitely recommend picking these up. And then they do have um, two of these Moxie glosses. These are their plumping lip gloss formula that smell like mint. They have Maverick and Charmer for $5.99. And then this is super exciting. We found the MAC Glow Play Blush in a new shade. This one is in Cheer Up. I'm trying to think if this is the one that I have. I feel like it is because I have a really light pale pink like this and it's so pretty. Love these cream blushes. They are incredible. And this is going for $12.99. So, so far we've seen two shades in this. Also seeing this MAC Dazzle Glass. This one is in the shade Go For Gold. And this one is $5.99. I'm seeing they put out some new Kate Somerville skincare. So I wanted to go over that. We have the liquid exfoliate for all skin types. This is only $12.99. I haven't tried the liquid before, but I've tried like the actual scrubby one. We also have this oil-free moisturizer from them for oily skin. This is going for $24.99. Also, you guys love this one. They have the goat milk moisturizing cream. This one's $24.99. And then I also saw this. It's called the Dillo Oil Restorative Treatment for All Skin Types. Again, $24.99 for that one too. So I wanted to share those since they just put those out, it looks like. It's like they put out one gingerbread extra spicy palette from Too Faced here. Um, again, $29.99. We keep seeing this kind of randomly. And then I'm seeing these are new from Car Beauty. We've been seeing their palettes here, but these are lip colors from them. They're Liquid Rouge Vivid Lip Gloss. They have the shade 90s Girl, which looks really pretty. These are only $2.99. This one is in Lavish, Sin, Venus. This one's called Unknown, and then Teaser, and let's see, the last one is Spirit. So they have quite a few of those, and they're super affordable. I'm seeing a few new Revlon items in, mostly lip products here, some different sets. This is the Beauty on the Go for Fair and Light Skin Tones. So there's a look, it looks like a cream blush, a highlighting stick, and then a lip pencil looks really nice the colors it doesn't say the colors but yeah but it's a Revlon balm stain is the lip color and this is going for $5.99 they also have these little travel exclusive sets with some lipsticks this has five lipsticks in it from the super lustrous line these are the shades primrose cherries in the snow which is one of their best sellers black cherry pink velvet and coral berry this is $6.99 and they also have this guy, which has two of these lip creams. The plumping lip creams, they're fairly new, and a lip liner. This is only $4.99. These sets are so good, and Revlon honestly makes them amazing lip products, so I would definitely recommend. Here's the shades on these. Peony Buff, Spice Berry, and then Nude. And then this one we have seen before, but it's this little lip cube that has nine lipsticks in it from the Super Lustrous Collection. So this has even more good shades. It looks like different ones. Well, a couple of from the same um, set earlier, but this one is $7.99. Here's another Revlon item. The four Revlon Kiss Cushion Lip Tints. There's four of them in here. I haven't seen these before, but this is only $5.99. And the shades here are some pinky coral shades. 
They also have these Urban Decay Wired Lip Chemistries that I showed at Marshalls. They still just have this purple shade in Gravity so far, but I wanted to show that they're at both stores. They also have this from Buxom, which this is going to be in my Ross video because I found it there as well. It's the Divine Goddess Luminizing Highlighter Palette. This one is going for $14.99. There's three different highlights in here, so exciting to see some more Buxom stuff here. And I found this as well, which I might get this. This is the little mini Flower Bomb Bomblicious Edition. It's a little spray. It's actually kind of pricey though. It's $19.99, so actually I think I'm going to pass on this one. But really cool to see more Flower Bomb stuff here. Okay, this is exciting because this is a newer product from First Aid Beauty that we haven't seen here yet. We see a lot of their skincare here, but this is the Oat and Hemp Multi-Fix Salve. This stuff is amazing for giving super hydration. I always use it on like my elbows and knees where my skin is the most dry. And it works really good. This is $9.99. I always see all their stuff here. It's crazy. I do have quite a few First Aid Beauty restocks, but I don't know if we've seen these before. The acne clearing pads from them with white clay. I think these are fairly new too. That came out like earlier this year. This one is $9.99. And then I'm seeing these as well from Pure. These are kind of older though, so I don't know about them, but they're the eye polishes. I used to like these when they first came out. They're super sparkly. It's like a liquid um, topper. And this one is only $3.99. Here's kind of what it looks like. This is in silk. They also have the shade Satin. And there is one more shade of these eye polishes in cashmere. Almost missed this one. There's only one of them here, but this is from Soap and Glory. I don't really see their stuff here that much. Sometimes like gift sets, but this is the kick ass <laughs> all day wear long wear foundation. This is only $5.99. Sorry, it's super loud in here. This, let's see, is there a shade? I don't see the shade. It says 24 hour wear and sweat proof. So it looks actually pretty good. I'd consider picking it up if they still sell it, so I'm gonna have to do some research on this, but it seems like it would be a good one for oily skin. We're seeing more Moda brush sets, which is exciting, and they have this super cute one. These are the mythical brushes, so they look like little mermaid fins. So cute, um, with the green and pink. And let's see, these are going for $9.99 for the whole set. Super cute brushes. I love the Moda brush quality. There's a powder, complexion, highlight crease, and then an eyeshader brush in here. They also have this new e.l.f. brush set. We saw one last week, but this is the Complexion Perfection brush set from them in this little package. This is for $6.99, and you get four brushes for face, and it looks like one eye brush as well. Or I guess you could use it as concealer brush. Okay, the other store I went to had a fun new color in these Vice Lip Chemistries. This one is in Savage, which looks like a very bright pink color. So it seems like these are very bright. I guess it goes with the whole Wired palette, which has like neon colors in it. But yeah, I'm glad we're seeing more of those. This week I'm on the hunt for a NARS palette that I've seen sneak peeks of, so I don't know if we will find it, but hopefully we will this week, or if not, maybe next week. Um, this store also has this again, the Pure Love Your Selfie 3. I think I went over this before, but it's $6.99. I actually do like the quality of these shadows. I think they're really soft, very pigmented colors. Definitely recommend, and it has the cute packaging. And my store is also restocking these Pure Crystal Clear Jumbo Highlighter and Bronzer Palettes. $4.99 for this. They had two of them here. Definitely super affordable. I'm noticing even more of these Pure Out of the Blue Palettes. Pretty much all, all the stores, they have them, like one. But this one does look pretty. It's like a mirrored palette. I think it lights up too. It's going for only $4.99, so that is like the cheapest price I've seen for a palette, which is crazy, especially for Pure. And then I wanted to mention, they're also bringing this back. I saw it a long time ago, but um, I actually have this one. It's the Revolution Shadow Palette. It's supposed to be a dupe for the Huda New Nudes. It's called Forever Flawless Allure. It's $4.99. Um, I tried mine the other day. I wasn't super impressed with the quality, so I did want to mention that. It looks pretty, but the Huda is a thousand times better. Here's some more Urban Decay. We have a Glide On Lip Pencil from them, and the shade is Streak. They have two of these here, both the same shade, going for only $4.99. I love their lip pencils. They are so good, so I would definitely recommend them. If we find more, that would be awesome. G Max also has one shade of the Urban Decay Vice Lipsticks. It's the one we saw at Marshalls a couple weeks ago in the shade at Check Me. I do love this formula, it's really good. This is $6.99, and they are restocking on the mini Naked Skin Concealers, again, for only $3.99, which is a really nice price if you just wanna try it out. They have a few different shades. Looks like they also have a wire Dumble Ended Eyeliner Top Coat. I haven't seen this pink shade before. This one is in Amped, which is a pink shift plus a black liner. I didn't really like these, they're $4.99. 
um, they have a ton of different like boxes and carts out but I can't really go through all of it because that would be a mess but I might have to check back in a couple days. They also put out a bunch of these Buxom lip glosses in the shade Alyssa. They seriously have like five of them all in the same color. I've been seeing a bunch of different ones of these lately. These are $5.99, my favorite lip glosses. Every time I'm here, I always see more perfume. It's always a big thing for the holidays. They have this cute Toka Contemporaries Duo with a little mini Gia and Maya perfume for only $10.99. They also have this cute little Kate Spade one, which has two sprays in it. This is originally $38, going for $19.99 here. The scents are In Full Bloom and then In Full Bloom Blush. This Lancome perfume set is super cute as well. It comes with, I think, five of their minis. It's called Best of Lancome Fragrances. Here they are. I love the middle one, Livia Spell. That one's so good. This is for $49.99. It looks like they are point. They're all different sizes, I guess. So point 16 seems to be the common. Okay, this Viva La Juicy set is so pretty. I love the packaging on this. This is the rose one. Pretty sure I've had this one before. Um, I don't know if they still are making it, possibly. Um, it comes with the 3.4 fluid ounces. This is $49.99. You get the perfume, and it looks like a couple other things as well in there. But yeah, this is adorable. I would just display the packaging because it's so pretty. They also have this cute Ren kit. We've been seeing more of their stuff here lately. It says stop being so sensitive. So this is their sensitive skin line. Uh, it looks like possibly mini sizes. There's the Ever Calm Gentle Cleansing Milk, the um, Ultra Comforting Rescue Mask, the Anti Redness Serum, and the Global Protection Day Cream. I do enjoy their skincare, and this is going for $16.99. They also have a bunch of these from the brand Cake Beauty. They make really nice hand creams, and they just started hair care too, but I really like their hand creams, and they have the Milk Made Candied Oat uh, Milk Cream. Their stuff smells so good. This is a weird price though, $3.79. Usually their stuff is always $3.99. So that was interesting, but they have a bunch of those here, so that's actually really cool to see that brand. Also spotted this kit from L'Oreal, which I thought was kind of interesting. It's the Beautiful Eyes Collection, which has their Age Perfect, it looks like eye cream, and then a Lash Magnifying Mascara. I don't see much L'Oreal here, so that's pretty cool. This is going for $14.99. Look how stocked the store is with gift stuff. There is so many things, especially this one. I feel like they always have a lot. And they have like bins and carts out everywhere. So I feel like they don't have room to put stuff out. I just hit the Ray Dunn mug jackpot. I cannot believe all these. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm going to get a couple for sure, but this is so many. And I saw these jingle bells. Oh, that's so cute. So I always like to film my haul at the end of these videos to show what I picked up and you guys saw that I hit the Ray Dunn Christmas jackpot. It took everything in me not to go crazy. I have a lot of Christmas stuff from them already so I just got a couple things. I was so excited to find this. I never find these super cute ones and this is like a mini canister that says Jingle Bells with a little Santa hat. And yeah, it's a little canister. This is such a good find. People go nuts for these. This was $14.99. Yes, my best find of the week. I saw so many mugs this week. I think this is one I picked up. I got a couple for friends. Um, like I picked up that apple cider one and also the deck the halls one for a couple of my friends. But I did get this one. I think I got this this week. <laughs> I think this was Monday, the let it snow. Because I thought this was so pretty as well. But yeah. I tried to be good. I didn't go crazy. And then this was also one of my best finds this week. I didn't expect this to be there because we saw the little mini moisturizer, but I thought we saw all the milk. I didn't think any new stuff was coming in, so you never know. We might even see more in the future. I would love to find the full-size moisturizer, but we found the full-size vegan milk cleanser, and it's so cheap, $7.99. I could not believe it. I remember people were raving about this line for the past year or so, and I cannot wait to try this out. They also have a mini one there, but of course we had to get the full size. I mean, come on. So I got that. Really excited. I only saw this at Marshall's so far this week, not at TJ Maxx yet. I also stocked up on my Shiseido cotton. I honestly should have bought more, but I am completely out, and I always see these at TJ Maxx. These are the softest, fluffiest cotton squares. This was $7.99, and you get... How many is in here? Does it say... 165 sheets. I know some people that cut them up um, in half and use them that way too so they last longer. I went a little crazy on the max stuff this week. My store never gets good max stuff so 
good stuff is trickling in. I found one of their new glow play blushes and we found a dark color a few weeks ago. Now this is the one I have and these are very similar but they have different names so I was like is this the same or not? I think it's slightly different. So this one is called Cheer Up and basically I guess I'm collecting these now. I love cream blush. I'm wearing mine right now in Cheeky Devil as just a little bit of something. It's very very natural so yeah mine is Cheeky Devil. Let's see how different these really are. Are these the same? Why do these look so similar? I think it's slightly different. Like maybe a little bit more peach. This is mine and this is the one that's at TJ. So it is a little bit darker. Let's swatch. So this one is, sorry, the light is just crazy today. Um, I'm filming in natural lighting and it keeps going in and out. This one is Cheer Up. Highly recommend these if you find them. My stores, I've seen it just one at each store, so these are hard to come by. And then I picked up this highlighter, so excited. Both of my Marshalls got this in, only one at each store again, so these are really hard to find. I know a lot of people are like, I can't find these things, but it is like hit or miss very much. Like, I'm going all the time, <laughs> so not everyone's going to do that, of course, but, I mean, you can't expect to find every single thing there because um, a lot of people are looking for these items as well. This is a MAC highlight that I picked up in the shade Double Gleam. This looks so beautiful. I cannot wait. Such a pretty highlight. It's like a nice champagne. And here it is, a swatch. I definitely recommend getting this if you guys see it. It is so beautiful. And then I also got a lip gloss. We're seeing more glosses. I love this color. And the name is really cute too. It's called Boy Bait. <laughs> And this is just a really perfect nude gloss, so I decided to get this. I don't have any MAC glosses in my collection. The Cream Sheen Lip Gloss. These smell so good. The vanilla scent. I live for it. So this is a peachy nude. I think this is going to be so, so pretty. So I'm really excited about these MAC finds. I feel like we found some really good stuff. But anyways, that is what I got at TJ Maxx and Marshalls this week. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye, guys.